getting a little bit emotional right now, so I'll start. So I'm Cheeky, or Rayleigh, as some of you guys may know. I'm daughter number two, and I just want to say how grateful and thankful I am that God has given me my mom, and that I am her daughter. She's a very strong woman um, who definitely inspires me every day, and Seeing her strength gives me the strength to carry on through my life. And I'm very thankful for that. Two on two. Hi, I'm daughter number three. Um, as you know, Faith. Um, I would like to, I'm very thankful for my mom. She, like Atatiki said, very strong woman, um, very smart. She, yeah, she got her master's, guys. Like, I think we should all applaud my mom for getting her master's. Why are being the nurse and having being the mother of four kids? Um, um, she works really, really hard every day. Like, she comes home stressed. I'm like, Mom, how do you do it? And she looks at me and she takes a deep breath and she's like, I'm going to retire soon. But then she goes to work the next day and she always puts in her all and inspires me to put in my all. Um, my mom is also one of the sweetest people. My mom is the sweetest person ever. She's very kind and loving, and we all wouldn't be here if it wasn't for her mom. My mom, it's her favorite song. Oh! <laughs> okay. So I'd like just, just like to say, um, I'm very grateful for you, mom. You are the most supportive person in my life. No matter what, you'll be there. You give me rides everywhere. Before I go, you give me rides everywhere. You're my personal Uber driver. Um, and you always push me, even though I'm a very late guy. You always push me to do my, to try my hardest and really find something I enjoy to do. So I'm really thankful to have you. I love you too much. Uh, hi. <laughs> um, yeah, um, Jesus Christ growing up, but I did not know what it was to have a person 
personal relationship with him. It wasn't until I became born again and accepted Jesus Christ as my Savior. He is my provider. God gave me four kids. He will provide four kids for me when they go and do whatever they want to do. So I just, I thank God. And, and to my kids' friends, I just want to say thank you to all for hanging out with my children. You know, Julia, I thank you for Ricky being Ricky's um, friend and, you know, keeping her intact in church. Isha, you've been friends since fourth grade. So, thank you. Uh, my family here, Maria, the two Marias, thank you so much. I truly, truly appreciate you. And, um, my church kids, I have grown, I've seen you guys grow up. I can't wait to see what you guys will become. So, I do want, the reason why I want you guys here all together is because I was told that whatever comes to my mouth should always be blessings. So I am here to bless you guys all. So I'm going to pray. Father in heaven, I give thanks to you, Lord God, for everything, Lord, that you have bestowed upon me. I pray, Father, that you will bless each one of them that's here and give them, Lord, the provisions that they need. I pray, Father, that they will know you and that they put their life in you and trust in you because, Lord, you are my, you are the provider, the maker. You have created us. You have great plans for us, Lord God. So I pray, Father, that you bless everyone who's here. Lord God, may, you, may they have a relationship with you, the same, I ha the same kind of relationship that I have with you. Because Lord, of all the things that goes on in this world, it is only through you that gives me strength, disciplining my kids. Yes, Lord. And um, all the blessings that you have bestowed. So I pray, Father, that you bless everyone here. And Lord, I pray for healing, Lord God, for my for my cousin too, Lord, who's just went for a bone marrow transplant. So I just thank you all for being here and um, thank you so much.